lesson, we're going to talk about the New Orleans traditional syncopated second line. This is a groove that I feel is very important to tackle. It's going to help you improve your groove in a lot of other areas. There are some nuances here that are particular to this groove, but these nuances, if you can get them down, they're going to translate to a lot of other grooves in a lot of other contexts as well. Let's take a look now at what is going to be our basic New Orleans syncopated second line groove. This is going to be our foundation. We're going to vary things from here, but this is going to be our starting point, and this is what we're going to be continuing to come back to. Now we're going to take that and we're going to add buzzes to it. We're going to add super crushed buzz rolls, then we're going to gradually elongate those till we're aiming for a seamless buzz roll. This is what we call thing number three, or thing three in the buzz roll lesson, which is academy lesson number one. This one and three pulse can get a little static, so I have a go-to variation that I like to do, which is where we just anticipate the one of the second measure. It's a little bit of a variation, but it's not too adventurous, and it's a good go-to pattern for me, and I like to start off with this one often. Now we can start to talk about varying the bass drum a little bit more. One of my favorite things to do is to chase the accents. And what that is, is we're going to chase the snare drum accents with a note immediately following on the bass drum. So right now I'm going to play four bars where I'm going to play our two bar pattern and repeat it and chase those accents. Then I'm going to play over the bar line and chase the accents. Even though we've been talking about this traditional New Orleans syncopated second line, I do want to point out that I use this kind of stuff and I use these ideas in funk and other styles and contexts all the time. So right now, I'm just going to go ahead and play a little bit of funk and then I'm going to use some of these traditional New Orleans buzzed second line ideas as my fills. If you enjoyed this video, please hit the like button as well as the notification bell so you can be notified when I post future lessons and videos here on my YouTube channel. I would love to have you come check out StantonMoreDrumAcademy.com. I have over 20 hours of video lessons there as well as over 300 pages of written lessons as well. I would love to have you join and become part of the SMDA community. Thank you all for checking this out. See you down the line.